Hello and welcome to the Shop Extreme review of the IWAP line uh, universal chargers. Uh, this is the base model, the IUC11, uh, which will charge all types of 3.6 and 3.7 lithium ion batteries. Um, it comes with the charger itself and an AC adapter, and these are just some of the batteries that it uh, can charge. So let's get right to it. First thing you do is just uh, open it up with some releases and as you, if you can see there are two small pins that move back and forth that allow you to um, cater it to whatever sort of battery you're using and then there's also a, a slide that will lock uh, the battery in place depending on what size it is. So the first one we're trying out is uh, a very popular Canon MB4L replacement. So if you, if you can see there are the there are the charging um, terminals, a positive and a negative on the outer edges. And the great thing about this charger and all the chargers is that it automatically recognizes which one is positive and which one is negative. So you never have to worry about putting a battery in backwards or upside down or something like that. So you just align the pins like so and press it in. As you can see, the ready uh, light turns on and then you just slide the uh, slider into place to secure it and you can uh, close the lid if you want, although it's not necessary. And then you just plug it in to the AC adapter. And as you can see, uh, the light goes yellow. It stays yellow on the ready uh, light and the charge the light uh, is red <clears throat> up until the point where the battery is about 95% done, at which point the ready light will go off and the charge light will turn green and then you can just charge it for another 30 minutes and it will be fully charged. So that's the MB4L. Let's uh, try out the BCG-10E. There, the, uh, there are the terminals again. And all you do is tweak the pins just a little bit, slide into place, and this one's actually 95 or above, so you, as you can see, the charge light is green and it doesn't go yellow and red as with the MB4L. So just to show you another couple of batteries, this one's different in that the terminals are like so, they're not like the other ones, they're slightly bigger. Um, this one, actually I don't think I'm going to have to tweak these much, but just to give you an idea. And this one again is 95% uh, or more charged, so you can see. It's not charging as much. This one's a bit harder because as you can see the terminals are very very thin um, but we wanted just to make sure that we showed one with very thin charging terminals so that you could get an idea that yeah it really does charge any sort of battery uh, as long as it's 3.6 or 3.7 volt and a lithium ion. Once again I'm using all charge batteries so it's not really a surprise that um, this one has basically full charge. But one of the most interesting um, factors about this charger and the other chargers is the power bank function. And um, if I can show you, what it allows you to do is charge, it allows you to uh, charge any device that can connect via a USB port right here with a battery in the battery tray. So I'm going to show you how it will charge this um, this uh, device that recharges um, AA batteries that are rechargeable. And right now I have the MB4L in there and it has it has charged. So as you can see, um, it's using the, the power of the MB4L, it's charging these two rechargeable AA batteries. And uh, it doesn't have to be something like this, it can be anything that charges uh, via USB, USB connection, so an iPod or any other sort of device that you can connect to your computer to charge will also charge using this function.